In round five, start with one chain stitch, and then work twenty-four single crochets. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Then work twenty-four single crochets in total. We need to work one single crochet in each stitch. Ten V shapes on the side stand for ten single crochets. Continue to work forty more single crochets. Twenty-four single crochets are done. Remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round five is done. In round six, start with one chain stitch, then work it off. Three single crochets, one increase for six times. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Then work set of three single crochets, one increase for six times. The first set, work three single crochets.
three encroaches are done. Next, work one increase, which means working two encroaches in the same stitch. Three encroaches and one increase are finished. One set is done. Keep working five more sets. The second set, work through some crochets. Next, work one increase. The second set is done. The third set, work three single crochets and one increase. We have demonstrated three sets here. Please finish the rest of three sets by yourself. Work three single crochets and one increase as one set. Six sets are done. Remove the marker. And work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round six is done. The stitches for rounds seven to eight are all the same. In rounds seven to eight, work one chain stitch, thirty some crochets, and one slip stitch for each round. In round seven, start with one chain stitch. Then work one single crochet in each stitch. There will be thirty single crochets in total. Also remember to mark the first stitch. Let's continue. Continue to work some crochets in the same way, and finally end with one slip stitch. There will be a total of thirty some crochets. Please finish rounds seven to eight by yourself. Work one chain stitch, thirty some crochets, and one slip stitch for each round. Round eight is done. Stretch the loop and remove the hook. We'll insert safety eyes between rounds seven and eight, spacing two eyes six stitches apart. We should put this row of slip stitches on the back. Such a bulge is one round. Check the position.
turn the fabric, and put on the sifted back pieces. Two eyes are completed.